everybody this is jade um i went to go see my sister this weekend so i did end up stopping by hobby lobby um that was on the way to see her it's one that i don't usually go to because it's way 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 far out from my house um but i did find a few items that i haven't seen in any of the stores that i've been to recently so i picked up a few more things um first i found this helix cutting mat it's a translucent cutting mat 12 by 18 um, and my old one is filthy, so, um, I decided it was a good deal, so I did buy it. It was $4.99, um, and this is what it looks like. Um, I actually have a huge, a, a bigger cutting mat, but my desk is a little too small for it, I think. So, I'm storing it away until I, such a time I get a desk that is big enough to handle it. So I did get that, found these two storage cases there, which I thought would be great for like all the different colored pencils I have collected and pens and stuff that you guys, that you guys have seen that I hauled. Um, and they were $2.49 a piece, so I, I only saw two there, so I got them both. Um, so I'm happy to have those for some storage. Um, found this watercolor paper. 324 they're six by nine and 140 pounds um it says there are 25 sheets in this but i wonder if it's not 25 per stack because that kind of looks like the whole thing kind of looks like more than 25 but i could be mistaken but i will see when i open it so again 324 found this friendship bracelet um book i used to love making these when i was younger when i was a kid it was only 99 cent and i figured that it would be nice to um give this a go again and try it out um and this is like a whole bunch of different designs that i've never even thought of trying so um 99 cent yeah thought it was a good deal i found these two storage envelope things First of all, this one is just says it's a deck protector. It was due, reduced from $3.99 to $0.99. Cent. Um, <coughs> excuse me. And it's basically to protect your gaming cards and stuff like that. Uh, or like, Mar I used to collect like Marvel comic cards when I was younger. I actually still have my collection. They're in mint condition. My brother keeps trying to take them. We both, me and him both, we used to collect and I'm like, no, leave my stuff alone. That's mine. Um, so, these will be good for things like that. As you can see, that's how it goes. And they had these in different colors, too. There was, like, um, red. And I want to say, like, white as well. And then I also found these storage envelopes. They're 74 cent, 100 clear storage envelopes. And they're kind of tiny. So I'm not quite exactly sure what you can use them for. They're three and a quarter by one and three quarters. But I don't know. I'll find something. Um, next up, I did find more pins. Yay. So I got extras of the different pin sets, sets I was on the hunt for. And I did find the pack of gold and silver this that this was a dollar 49 like i said i, I um, saw actually both my creative ego and lp red flower haul these and they both like swatched them out or actually used them on a project and they were gorgeous i had to have them so i know i got these two but i, I wasn't sure i think this may be the only pair of the gold and silver that i got um but this one was a dollar 49 those are the colors and this is what they look like on the different papers, black and white. Again, I got these, 274. Here are the colors here. Here's what they look like on different background paper. And same here for this pack. So I was happy to have backup of those because they're so pretty. Um, again, my creative ego, she hauled these and used them and I wish because the first time I actually went and saw um, the clearance when I told you guys I was looking for those paints and I looked up happened to look up and all that stuff was on clearance um, the um, jelly rolls and all that 
these things were on clearance too and i wish i had gotten them then because she swatched these out and they are so pretty um and i wish i hope i can find the other pack and then i'll be satisfied um so they were four dollars and 24 cent down from 16.99 and they are the spectrum noir sparkle brush they're like glitter brush pens <coughs> So, I got this red, green, and blue. It, go check out my Creative Egos Hobby Lobby haul. This, they are so pretty. Oh, so pretty, guys. Again, $4.24. And this one is the um, metallic color. So, you have black, like a gold, and a silver here. So, I'm, I'm not sure if this is more gold or more like a... I don't know. It looks gold up here, but it kind of looks dull. And just a little picture. Sorry if there is a glare. I may have to rethink this ring light because the way it it, it bounces off some of this plastic and stuff. Um, again, let's see. I found some more erasers, which is lovely. And this is a three pack, ninety nine cent down from three ninety nine. And you have the kneadable eraser. I think this one is vinyl. And I remember these erasers from when I was a kid in school. I'm not exactly sure what they, they're called. Um, but... Eraser, it's a gum eraser. Sorry guys, I'm all out of frame. That's what it is, so... 99 cent, yes, I'll take it. I'm always erasing something, especially when I'm trying to draw something in my journal or somewhere else, so never have too many erasers found these deco pens they were $2.99 and these I've called some uh, these before but not the same pack and this one has black white and gold in it love paint markers I really do they are so useful especially coloring in like titles and stuff um again I found some different a different couple set of pens that I hadn't seen um, these are Faber-Castell Pit Artist pens, uh, like manga, to draw manga, and it has the India ink in them, and they're $3.99, and let's see, here's what they look like, the colors, I guess I should say, so I did pick those up, and another set of manga Faber-Castell pens, and these are eight Pit Artist pens. Again, India ink, and they are seven dollars and forty nine cent. Trying to get that glare off. Sorry, guys. Um, and here are all the different colors here. Um, and they look like they may have different points. So that's cool. Love my pens. Um, and then I picked up a few charms. I hadn't been getting a whole lot of charms lately, but I saw these and I kind of couldn't resist. Um, I thought they were really cute. So I found this little axe for 99 cents from the fairy tale collection. Um, down from $3.99. I just thought it was really cute. Um, and then I found these. These would be great for like um, putting on the outside band elastic um, for like TNs because they have little, they have holes on either side and they have little sayings. Um, one is, my good opinion, once lost, this is lost forever. Oh God, I'm all out of frame. Let's see if I can see what the others say. Um, Till this moment, I never knew myself. And this one says, I'm sorry guys, I'm so out of frame. Obstinate, headstrong girl. Sounds like me. $1.24. Um, and I love these, any little things like little, like little books. 99 cent for The Secret Garden. I love that book and movie. Um, especially when I was a kid. And then they had these cute little... Um, What's the lady's name? Of course, it escapes me right at this moment. I could tell you right away any other time. 99 cent <coughs> for all three of these books. Pride and Prejudice, Jane Eyre, and Romeo and Juliet. We all know that one, Shakespeare. 
you guys know who this is it's like right on the on the edge of my mind and i can't say the name for some reason um and i found this one and it says it's 99 cent and it just says dream and you guys know how i am about my dreams so i did pick that up and that is it for this haul i think i kind of wrapped up this go around or whatever um there are only a couple more things that i really would like so if i run across them great but you know it's not a big deal so we shall see i hope everyone had a great weekend and if it's during the week when i post this i hope you're having a great week and i will see you all in the next video thanks for watching bye